Hey guys, what is going on? Jedi Master Yeetle here, and today I'm going to be making a video of two of my own custom made up Jedi named Jedi Master Keta and her former apprentice, um, Jedi Knight Quinn. Okay, so, um, just said it, Master, her former apprentice, then before she died, he became a Jedi Knight, so yeah. Okay, so let me just start with the Master. Okay, so for Keta, I use this hair. Hang on, let me just get it off. I'm pretty sure I've used this more than once in one of my in some of my videos. Thought this hair would be suited for her, so yep. Yeah. Then I gave her this head. She can like kind of be talking with like either Masiota, some another Jedi, or her Padawan, like negotiating with them or talking about matters. And then out in battle, she can be fighting with angry face on. Okay, so for the rest of the body. Hang on, let me just take the cape off. Give her a brown cape. Um, I gave her Stas Ali's tu tunic. Dang it, she fell. Okay, so I gave her Stas Ali's tunic because I kind of liked it for her. Then normal white hands. And then I gave her Ray's legs because I kind of wanted her to have some detailing on her legs. That this was pretty cool. So, yep. Yeah. Okay, now time for her apprentice. Her former apprentice, Jedi Knight Quinn. He is a uh, Iktochi, same species as Saucy Tin. So, I'm pretty sure you should already know where I got his head piece, horn piece from. His head piece is Padawan Kenobi's. Um, I kind of liked it for him. I kind of want him to have this face, but I know he seems young for a Jedi Knight, but, well, actually, no, he kind of doesn't. Okay, so, um, if you turn this face around, he can be talking with his master or something like that, and then turn it around, then turn it like this. He can be out in battle fighting with his master. Okay, so for the torso, I use Agent Kolar's torso, torso and then Coleman Trebler's legs printing, leg printing. She died on a mission to Ryloth, not with her print, not with her Jedi Knight apprentice by the time she died, but she was killed by Asajj Ventress along with three other Jedi. But two other Jedi that went on the mission with her escaped, and this was during the Clone Wars. So pretty much. He died during during the Great Jedi Purge when Anakin attacked the temple. He was killed by Anakin. So, pretty much, yeah. Okay, so that's pretty much it for my video, guys. Make sure to subscribe to my channel. Give me a thumbs up. And tell me in the comment section below who you think I should make next. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.